जय श्री कृष्णा फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माई हेल्थ एंड टेस्ट टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू मेक पनीर चीज़ पराठा विच यू कैन मेक वेरी इजीली इवन वेन यू आर इन हरी इफ यू फाइंड इट डिफिकल्ट टू रोल अ पराठा आफ्टर स्टफिंग देन हेयर इज एन ईजी वे टू मेक दिस स्टफ्ड पराठा विच कैन बी मेड इजीली एंड वेरी क्विकली बट बिफोर दैट प्लीज डो नॉट फर्गेट टू सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल एंड मेक श्योर यू क्लिक द बेल आइकन टू रिसीव नोटिफिकेशन ऑफ ऑल द अपकमिंग यमी रेसिपीज so before starting let's quickly run through the ingredients friends i have also updated these ingredients in the description box below so that you can go through them later as well so we'll start with crumbling our paneer and mashing it properly to this we'll add chopped onions kasuri methi all the spices that we've taken then we'll add chopped coriander and we will mix everything together so that everything is well combined everything is mixed properly all the spices are mixed properly and will it will look something like this so now it's time to grate some cheese into our mixture i've taken 5 cheese cubes you can take more if you want but make sure to add less salt because cheese is also salty now mix them well and the stuffing is ready now for making the dough we need wheat flour and water mix water little by little and make a dough which is not very hard not very soft it's moderately soft dough it should look something like this now from this dough form a ball roll this ball in dry flour and then form a chapati out of this make sure the chapati is thinner at the edges and thicker in the center then we'll stuff our paratha with the stuffing that we prepared be generous in putting the stuffing so here i've put a lot of stuffing into this and now because we do not want to roll the paratha again i'm just sealing this paratha in the style of dominos garlic bread see this isn't it easy and quick we are done with our stuffed paratha and we just have to cook it now So we'll put it on a tawa and we'll cook from one side. Once it is cooked from one side, slowly and gently flip it and cook it from another side. Once it is half cooked from both the sides, apply ghee or oil on one side and then flip it and apply ghee on other side as well. Cook it properly. Press the corners gently while you cook the paratha. I generally make these kind of parathas when I have to do a quick cooking because rolling the stuffed paratha for the second time is a little time consuming job but believe me if cooked properly these parathas also taste just superb flip and cook again look at this beautiful color you can see some stuffing oozing out but at this stage it's perfectly fine to have it we have generously filled our paratha so our stuffing won't fall short A stuffed paratha always tastes great when it contains a good amount of stuffing. Time to serve and cut it into two halves. A beautiful and fully overloaded stuffed paratha is ready now. See the stuffing. Oh, it's really hot. Well, we are done now. Let's serve it with some coriander chutney or anything you like, curd or butter. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Please do not forget to like, share, comment and subscribe. Eat healthy, stay happy. Bye-bye.